he's just big chilling up there, isn't he? Look at him go. <laughs> I have to make myself be entertained in these times in which I'm not streaming. And then I get everything set up and then I have like two minutes left until the prerequisite time that I have declared as stream time. Thus, I get to dick around in the stats screen. Because I'm going to be honest, it did actually take me like a noticeable amount of time to figure out where the fuck my social stats are. Like, you'd think it'd be in the stats menu, and yeah, you'd be right, but I didn't think that, you know, then tab into him, and then tab into here. That was a big pain in the ass. I went through, like, all the fucking menus. I'm gonna go study. Plant? No. DVD? No. How do I study? Nap time. Hey! Oh, it's downstairs, that's right. It's gonna be like, wait a minute, how do I study? Where am I right now? I don't wanna do the crossword puzzle, I wanna study, thank you. Now listen up. What do you wanna do? Make sure you're close. Just up. gets it out of the way, you know what I mean? Wow. Please, please, please rank up my knowledge. <laughs> Thank God. All right. Well, uh, that was physically painful. All right. You believe in the Phantom Thieves? No, I don't actually. I'm here, and I don't believe in it. School assembly during exam week? Oh my god. Unbelievable. Seems pretty rough. The fucking audacity of this school. Hello there. Well, shall we begin? No. Oh, I'm not allowed to say. <laughs> but it's Yoshitsune. Ooh, we can do this. Hey, let's see here. Why the reason for you viewed as a hero? I don't you're a Tomo, I had to guess. Is there like the same kind of name? Ah, there you go. Yoritomo one. Didn't Yoshitsune die? Yeah. The weak. Man, I wonder what they could possibly be referencing with this line of dialogue, Morgana. Also, the fact that Morgana can just cheat by telling us this shit, and he chose not to it ahead of time. <laughs> Ons right there, you can cheat for her too. Oh, that was it? Or no, there's probably still more. I'm, I'm kind of surprised I got them all right. Let's get started. Hello. Um. I don't remember him bringing up any of this. I don't remember the term. I would have to guess cognition. Because it's the term thrown around ever. I don't remember the word exaltation in this context. I don't think it's obstruction. And hallucination just doesn't sound right. It's an optical illusion, so I would say cognition. Ooh, we can do this. Yeah. Yeah, you can do it with all of them. It's the whole, like, color theory thing we were talking about. I remember, I'm playing the game. Okay, class, let's get started. <laughs> In the book that defined malefactors, cheap back parts of human race. Ah, oh, fuck. Digital Devil Story. Mm -hmm. 
I guess... I don't actually remember any of these names. This is a good good reference, though. Digital Devil Story Megami Tensei is the original book that started this entire fucking franchise. Because, yep, it wasn't Shin Megami Tensei or any of that shit. It was originally just called Megami Tensei, and it was Digital Devil Story Megami Tensei, the novel with Nakajima. <laughs> Devil's Dictionary, I guess. I have no fucking idea. Yeah, because I was gonna say that's the closest one. They're giving you like a fake out answer. Femme Fatale, wow, look at that. Columbina. Ooh, we can do this. Isn't it great when it's been like a week between some of these? Because, I mean, I'm kind of doing these every day now, but half of these questions did come like a week ago. So, I got, uh, I got some sauce going in my brain. <laughs> Nice. And then I have at least a rank 2 knowledge, which should be enough to get me like a decent mark, so you know what I mean? Ever since that specific incident, Egghead. many of you have voiced concerns that I could not bear to ignore. We believe the mental health of our student body is absolutely vital, so we've acquired the services of a therapist. The floor is yours, Doctor. Isn't he hot? Oh no, he's hot. It's nice to meet you all. Whoa, his voice is sexy. And say hello to the when I was playing Royal, I'm like, damn, this song fire. I'm waiting for it to like get going. Because you bet I'm waiting. The best Royal Edition is this song. <coughs> there it is. Nice. Nah, I mean just the song. I don't know anything about this fucking guy. I don't have even met Kasumi in game yet, technically. Or like, properly. I mean, you saw her once of the early tutorialization bullshit. It's your fucking dumbass. No need to be formal with me, though. I'm just here to counsel anyone who's interested. You can even call me Doc, if that would help you feel more comfortable. Any assistance you need. I'm for another voice actor who's in fucking everything, but I can't name his name because I don't know names. I guess I'm not really any good for helping with money problems. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Maruki. Yo. Yeah, he's dead. Aw. That's not fun. That wasn't a fun fact at all, Bullet! <laughs> You ever expect this place to actually give a shit about our mental health? No. Well, our school's made national news. Maybe they figured they'd look even worse if they didn't- This is one of those songs that I always want to listen to, but I never want to look up anything about Persona 5. Especially because this is the obligatory new character, Ferdinand Von Eyre. <laughs> Is the obligatory like second new character and I don't know of any other new characters So we know Kasumi joins the party. So this dude's probably a shithead and is the new main villain I don't fucking know, but I want his song and I'm especially terrified to look up his song Because I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna find and I can't do it. I want this song though and Dr. Uh... Dr. Watson. And especially if I start listening, if like I have someone give me his song, if I start listening to it, YouTube will start recommending me things, and that is a terrifying concept. Maruki. Yeah, wasn't that guy just basically clowning it up on stage? He's living his best fucking life, Ryuji. You really think he'll do us any good? Yes. Ryuji. Hey there. I'm Ferdinand Sakamaki von Eyre. And Takamaki-san, right? 
And that must make you. Yeah, actually, now that you now that you bring it up, and the fact that he doesn't have like the microphone effect on, yeah, this is just Ferdinand. He's the best character. All right, Persona Five, they've done it. Well, I was informed of certain students before beginning my tenure here, those that had uh, previous interactions with Mr. Kamoshida. It must have been especially tough for you after having just transferred here. No. Quite the tough youngster. Just don't overdo it, okay? He's got so, a good vocal chops of the guy, man. Ah, yes. I'd forgotten. I know I already offered my services to the student body earlier. But would you three be interested in counseling? Nope, not at all. Huh? How's that surprising? You were just a touch more emphatic about it than I'd expected. Ah. But if you come to my office, you can have free snacks. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. All you can eat would be nice, but there's still plenty to be had. So, how about it? Tell me more of these snacks. He's got his fucking hooks into me. No. Ah, oh, god damn it. To be frank, Bad ending. I've been explicitly ordered to provide counseling to the students directly involved with Mr. Kamoshida. It's in the school's interest. For its students. Ah, the school's interest, huh? I know that asking you to be open with a complete stranger like myself is a lot. Making this mandatory wouldn't do you any good either. Might as well turn it into a worthwhile experience. Ooh, I know. If you attend my counseling sessions, I'll teach you different ways to improve your mental acuity. Like ways to hone your concentration before exams, or not getting nervous on dates. How's that sound? Uh... Mental training. I make good use of this. It may aid in our phantom thievery activity. -ry. There's also snacks. Oh fuck yeah, dude. All right, all right. Enough with the snacks. Oh please, keep keep these honeyed words coming. So. Which way are you leaning? I'm leaning towards snacks. <sighs> I guess it'd just be more trouble for us if we didn't go. Hmm, yeah. Really? Then I guess it's a deal. I'll be in the nurse's office. Feel free to come by whenever it's convenient for you. He's got a goddamn saccharine sweet smile full of sinful vice. And holy shit am I in for it. And I'm into we it. Get going. I'm getting them snacks. Okay, I'll see you later. Hooray, Spectre shared it's games are now available for you to play. <laughs> now that we have a deal, I promise I'll do my best to help you. Hey, that's you, Bullet. There you are. You're on screen now. Good job. You're live on the... Oh, shit. No, you don't get to say... Ooh. Oh, yeah, we're doing this bug again? All right. Oh, man, very ominous of a stare down. Look what you did, Bullet. You broke... Oh, and there it goes. Now the drugs have kicked in. You did it. Good job. I'm proud of you. I hate it when my flash forwards take a little while to, like, you know, orient it's hard themselves. I believe an ordinary high school student could accomplish such grandiose heists. One would need a heart of steel, unaffected by outside influences, and prepared to act without hesitating. Clearly not, because we did it originally. There has to be someone who helped strengthen your mental state. Sound like somebody you know? No. No, actually, I genuinely do not know this Give man. Me a name. Fuck you. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the way Fight me, banana man. With the birth of a <laughs> That's not even an arcana. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're just making shit up now. So hold up, dude. Sorry for keeping you like this. Well then. How is he making that noise? <laughs> OK, 
Okay, quiet down. Through November, okay. Yeah. I actually did know that. I'm just veg making shit up now because it's the wrong set, you know what I mean? I like what they did with uh, Adachis and Four, but they kind of made that one a bit obvious because if you know what the Jester is, you know that that's fucked. But then again, it's similar to um, Akihiko and Shinjiro's Persona, where if you know the actual mythology and story behind them, it uh, gives you a little taste of what's to come. Yeah, dude. Yes. He's brought on the dullest and tones. <sighs> Welcome. <laughs> what kind of snack? Do you have fucking apple juice? Shall we nice. Begin? It's in a cup too. You get a cup of apple juice. You know, it is kind of telling, because it's actually, like, a strangely recent trend I've seen, is the fact that, uh... It's not even in, like, newer games, but it, there's been now, like, three different games I've seen where, like, a counselor has randomly been a shithead. Because they're like, oh, you know, they let you get in at the student body, so I'm like, I'm watching you, Maruki. These snacks are all just a veneer, ain't they? Now that I think about it, one of those wasn't a game. One of them was like a like a novel. Y'all ever read Worm? Worm's really good. It's a web novel. It's very, very good. I've probably talked about it on stream a few times, but I don't really ever get to talk about my habit of reading. So, you know. Quite. I'm gonna be honest, when I saw that title, I immediately just thought like, oh, it's Dune. And I'm like, no, it's completely different, but it's just... Very funny that I just immediately think of Dune, I hear worms. <laughs> yeah. Bunch of sand dudes. They're just dicking around down there. Be careful, okay? Okay, I'm gonna get going. It's gonna suck. Yeah, I've actually interacted with a few counselors in my life, but they're actually not too bad. I've never really had a bad experience with a counselor. 
I interacted with the counselor a ton in like elementary school. How are you? So I have a good I have a good history with counselors. I like them. They're neat. They're fun. That's a good job. I was a fucking shithead in elementary school, dude. He was super nice. One of one of those like core memories, you know, that you kind of just hold on to life is just random flashes of the fucking like counselor from my elementary school. He's like the main thing I remember from that school. And the dude was badass, absolutely. He was super nice and he helped me get through a bunch of shit my little dumbass kid brain didn't understand how to handle. I don't want her in my party. Welcome. I mean a deal. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, friendship. Kinda gotta kinda gotta pay attention to that, don't I? Let's see. that I make enough money to be able to reliably pay bills without needing to worry about it too much and not having a car that's broken down so I can reliably know that I'm going to be able to get to work every day. Um. want Maruki to be a shithead. I'm gonna be honest. That's like the absolute leading theory because of like my shitty meta game knowledge is the fact that well they had to make someone new that's a shithead because uh, what is the fucking point? But I'm like, man, I don't want Maruki to be a shithead. I like counselors. How about it? So I'm hoping that he isn't. Friendship. I didn't even ask for this rank up. That's just cheating. I'm not even against the two. Status ailments are ass. And we did have some fucked shit happen with status ailments. So the fact that I could just randomly be immune is pretty All good. Right. So that's value. He's I out here walking around with the fucking status ailment immunity. We're probably gonna focus his social link down just because it's no. new, you know what I mean? Then he does uh, this. All right. Max SP increased by five. So you get your max HP increased by five if you work out in your room, which is what that chair was all about. That's actually extremely useful because it's the only way to increase your max HP without going to a goddamn grindy fest. However, max SP is not quite as useful, but at least it's neat. Like max XP, SP is useful for like the invit. Well, actually, no. Invigorate restores by a flat amount nowadays. Never mind. 
Max SP is not super useful, but it's something. Thank you. On static. See you. <laughs> I didn't know why I needed that, but all right, thanks. I can now chew this while making a computer. <laughs> I guess I should say building. I'm not crafting a computer from the earth. Good night. I must check out what the gum does. Oh. Yeah, it is pretty nice, but it's just the fact that max SP is one of the less useful stats. It's not bad, but I'd rather have like something that, oh, it increases my SP. Oh, you fucker. They're only doing this because normally, yeah, you're not allowed to do anything. And I mean, at least this one is under- Can I work out, though? You bitch. This one at least makes sense, because in the original game, this was just a part of, like, the academy week. Academy? School? Yeah. That. This is part of the academy week, and, uh, you weren't able to do anything during this week, so... You're not allowed to do anything anyway. <sighs> so sleepy. I ended up pulling an all-nighter once I realized today is the last day of exams. You... staying up studying? Nah, I gave up on the exam. I was playing some games, and then before I knew it, it was morning. Oh, manly, damn. Eh, it's what I always do. No matter how many times I fail, nothing's gonna change. And so I like Junpei more. Junpei at least tried. Ryuji just gave the fuck up, said, fuck it, I'm not even gonna bother. Yo, look who else is yawning. Exams are almost over, so I thought I'd make one last effort across the finish line. Oh, impressive, Lady On. You're quite different from this stupid monkey I know. God, I hate you so much, Morgana. Huh? Don't give me that crap. Your brain's tiny compared to mine. Just start kicking him. You so won't be able to fight back in that form. There's nothing inside, you know. What was that? <sighs> Will you please shut up? You're gonna make me forget everything I remember. <gasps> Am I imagining things? What? You see a groper or something? No, that's not it. It's nothing. Okay. Hmm? So, uh, are we gonna, are we gonna get a cutscene or something, or? <laughs> uh, I love this game, how it randomly just takes fucking forever to do anything, it's great. I'm assuming it's still working, because I know if I click, things might start breaking, so we're gonna wait a bit. Just in silence. Oh, and I swear to God, I hope the game didn't fucking crash. Because this game takes like 10 fucking minutes to boot up, and that's like only a half exaggeration. This game takes a while to boot up, as well as the fact that I would have to redo absolutely everything, because I haven't really had a chance to save. I mean, I did have that one point briefly, but I'm going to be honest, I didn't think to save there for, you know, expected reasons of not expecting the game to shit the bed. Do we dare click? I'm taking the stab. Oh. Oh, that's not. Oh, no. Here, you know. <sighs> Come on. Wait for bro. Oh. Yes. Running it back. Hey, uh, are 
you sure it's him, or are you just that self-conscious? I'm not that... Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line! You are the one stalking me! Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been it's Aikichi. He's I'm back. That's because... Huh? Being a weird motherfucker. My goodness. I had wondered why you left the car. So this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. <laughs> I saw you from the car. And I couldn't help myself from chasing after you. It's also Chrome, I think. I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei. But thank goodness I caught up to you. I know this ain't actually Akichi, but he's very, very similar initial, like... <laughs> strange attitude towards women on first introduction energy. Which is a weird callback, but it's where I was okay. mentally at the time. From, from, to fire amble. What? Chrome... There you go. You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please, won't you? Wait a minute, I... Be the model for my next art piece. Yes. M model? Best character in the party. Fucking top of the tier list. All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. This man's highly suspicious. In the party. I don't give a damn whether he is or isn't. In the party, top of the tier list. Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? <laughs> Hold your horses. Who are you anyways? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. Also very similar to Aikichi because he goes to a different school. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I'm Motorame Sensei's pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Huh? Do you mean that, Motorame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? The very same. You know who that is? He was introduced as a super famous Japanese style artist who's been recognized all over the world. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Yusuke. I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. Yusuke, please. <laughs> Well then, I hope to see you. And San's not even here to see me just fucking gush about the best character. <laughs> that guy's as easy to read as a book. I want to hear everyone's. Where's floors? Where's lag? Okay, lag's here. I see that, but lag's lag. He's doing lag things. I think I will. I want to hear Scion and Flores' reaction. Cause I don't think I've ever actually said who my favorite character is, if we're already here. <laughs> Oh, there go my flash four. I need to save the game, actually. I am afraid of crashes. By that, I mean more more so just lockups, freezes, etc., etc. You became acquainted with Matarame's pupil by chance? That's a little too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. What I want to know most is your method. It's true that Matarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. But he'd been covering his tracks for years. How did you uncover the truth in such a short span of time? Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. If so, a different suspicion arises. 
People have gone mad or lost consciousness never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart, too. Were you related to those as well? <laughs> mm. I see. <laughs> Refusing not to oh. answer at all times. Let's get back to Madarame's case. Keep it concise. I know my rights, you bastard. <laughs> Also, I've talked about the song's also really good. Give him the cheer. How is he making that noise? Yep. <laughs> Bite me, banana man. <laughs> Everyone go watch Codement and understand that it is from a grander time. Witness the true power of being good on the internet. Everyone at home, that is your homework for today. Code meant. It's very good. Uh, it's over. It's over. It's over. How about you? <laughs> it's over. Come on, you two need to get your act together. You're the one who fucking started this. Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Hey, look, Madarame. They're gonna come back graded next week. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less, too. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. I know. Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. I want sushi then, or domestic raised eel. We don't have that much left. Oh, right. There are those tickets to Madarame's exhibit. Wait, that's tomorrow. Oh, yeah, Bullet, you actually missed out on it. Do you know the mechanics behind the lottery in this game? Because I had never even known about it before Scion told me, and it was a. Uh, a fucking great experience. Do you know the the system behind the lottery in this game? Don't tell me. Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? It's not like that. Yeah, I'll show you in just a sec. Oh, of course not. When I was watching that special Once you know, I gain access to fucking nice. gameplay. Plus, we've got free tickets. Besides, this could also be related to what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? Hmm. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Want to go appreciate some fine arts for once? Yeah, I could dead rising it up. Start throwing plants at people. Huh? I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. Well, if everyone's going... It's settled, then. Just the phrase, going to an art exhibit, sounds kind of mature. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. Okay. I want to go play game. Don't make me go to bed, cat. Nice catch. Please. I'm free. Bullet, I'm free. No, where's the save? Let's do it. Eventually. This game, this game increasingly concerns me. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna double save just in case. You know, like I said, this game is in making me increasingly concerned. Actually, let me check the plant. I know I did it not too long ago, but... That's good. Aw, oh, fuck, I can't leave, damn. No. 
fucking idea. Hey, um, so that means I have the ability to watch the DVD, study, or make more thieving tools. I have enough tools, so let's watch a movie. This gives me charm, sure. I will show you the lottery when I have access to the area that's not here. You think I go out with her? What do I look like? What? You liar! You told me you loved me just last night! Man. This is a weird song. It's almost like it's better than every song in this entire game put together. <sighs> wow, it's very strange how that works. Oh. There it goes. Hey, hey! Can now actually do the Big Bang Burger challenge, which is fun. It's raining. It's study time. Also Sunday time, so I gotta go get some sauce. Assuming I get to play the game. Because we're going to that fucking exhibit. It is still not rained at any point in this entire game to let me study and get a bonus for it. The game has deprived me of my knowledge. So crowded. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? You came. Oh, I came, all right. Um, yeah. You really came. <laughs> you have a sound so disappointed about it. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? I do not know why Ryuji loves this random, like, corner store hoodie so much. I love the purple. Purple, that's a fat shade of purple. But it's the fact that it's a 777 brand, which is just some random fucking supermarket. Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come now, I'll show you around. I mean, it does have the best song in the game. I'd like to draw too. Well, see you guys later. Bye. Will Lady Hun be all right? What if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? What the fuck are you doing, Morgana? I told you not to come out! Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Yeah, I absolutely buy it, but it's just so, so strange. <laughs> Dude, I love 7-Eleven. Yeah. I want to stay. Yeah, no, I like it here. Fine. We did come all this way, so I guess I'll look around too. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? Hmm? It's that old man from the other day. We continue We're on to be news. truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. It really, it really could see the difference between Akira and uh, Ryuji. Ryuji has a dirty tee untucked at his pants and he's slouching with a hoodie. Whereas Akira has a, I wouldn't even cut, that's just a shirt. It's just a shirt tucked into his pants with a belt, a nice jacket over it with his with boots and the jeans. Where in the boots world with does the fur, right? Come from? Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Naturally, you say. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. A shack? I see. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> Wasn't the word shack something... He's Shaquille O'Neal. He's a uh, very good basketball man. Over there. I'm so glad I came on opening day. Okay, you stop pushing. Ugh, there's way too many people. I'm getting crushed. Anyways, we gotta head for the exit. Don't die on us, all right? Good ending. I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. 
Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, since he creates all this by himself, he's special. There you are, Yusuke. Sensei. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. Indeed. Oh, this is it! The painting I wanted to see in person! This one? I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. Mm. Something wrong? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. Come now, this way. lady totally elbowed me but thanks to that I remember now well let me get to it it's about a post online here look at this why'd you leave without me I didn't consent to leaving actually you got it all wrong we got dragged into this huge crowd and eh, anyways you gotta look at this too this post might be about Madarame. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? Huh? If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask that oh. shadow from earlier yeah. about this. There we go. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. Man, it's nice to have a creaky ass chair, isn't it? Then again, I built it myself and I bought it myself, so. I get what I paid for, huh? And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with mementos? Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh. Yeah, right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? And wasn't it nice that like an hour ago I said, hey, you wanna hear about this lottery thing? Yeah, me neither. fits way too well to just be a coincidence. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Well, yeah, but is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitagawa-kun gave me his contact info and the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, that's what you meant. Can I have access to my knife, please? Okay. Do gotta check out the nighttime shopping though. 
Allergy relief. Hey, hey. That's fucking expensive. No, I'm good. The fact that it's not Tanaka mean makes me ask, like, what's the fucking point? You know what I mean? I can't. It's Sunday. Why would you deprive me of the ability to go get my oh Jiru? Oh, I want to go to the lottery, you bastards! <sighs> Time to watch more movies. the fuck do you mean, Charm? That was awful. I'm becoming a worse okay. person. I'm oh. run out of DVDs. I have now watched every single DVD they sell. <laughs> Can I play the game, please? Hey, okay, you're a teacher started. now. That's not right. The cheat. Any ideas? That's placebo. Yeah. This is it. Placebo. That's right. Hearts? What tryhards? What are you gonna be like that, man? Phantom Thieves, lol. Not even worth a laugh, but the other dude lolled though, so clearly it is worth a laugh. Which one is it, game? How dare this random forum it Phantom Thieves get each other you. wrong? <laughs> this ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. The train is the fastest way to go. Plus, we can bring pets on here. Hey, who are you calling a pet? Dude, be quiet! We didn't pay the pet fare! I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me Master. Oh, Kitty! Oh, shoot. Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. It's a little creature. What's a creature? Isn't that a kitty? It's... Um, a toy! It meows when you press on its head. You heard her. Press on its head. This is ridiculous! Me Again! Again! Oh yeah, just, just beat your shit out of him. This is a fun option, but nah, just get in there. Perfect. <laughs> Start manhandling the cat. The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on the left side. Oh, this is our stop. Well, see you later. Bye bye. Mm hmm. Bye bye. Who let you wander off and start harassing random people and their cat? Little children are a danger to society. They must so, be stopped. Which line do we got to transfer to? 
doesn't look like there are any stations close by to that address. If anything, this is the closest station. What? And we gotta walk the rest of the way? What kind of phantom thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining. It's supposedly a shack, but this is the neighborhood he lives in. As expected of a famous artist. Looks like the fastest route is to get to the station square and then go to Central Street. Let's move. Yep. I sure am. I see bread shop and vending machine. Hey. Don't you think we should hurry? God damn it. No, I don't want to hurry actually. Vending hey. machine. Fuck off! What are we down here? I'm I'm allowed to go down here because apparently Station Square is downstairs. It's one of those famous above ground subways. Oh. Yeah, it's this bullet. This is the lottery. This, this bitch. As well as there's this guy. I talked to him like a long time ago. Look at him. I wish I could paint again. It's his fault I have such a shitty life. What, are you okay? Leave me alone. He gets back gone and it's fucking over for me. He's a homeless guy. Yeah, but this is the lottery. It's pretty neat. I'll be able to show you what it does when I can play my fucking game. Teacher at Shujin Academy. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? The human mind doesn't change that easily, let alone their natural temperament. <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it, just in case. Is that it? We're at the right address. The door plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Who is it? It's made out of fucking rusty ass sheet metal. Look at that. Honestly, I couldn't see it just because it's uh, it's more noticeably distinct than the nearby surrounding buildings. It's definitely a look to it, you know. Sensei is currently. Um, it's Takamaki. I'll be right out. <laughs> People really do live here. Oh shit, he's here. Takamaki, sir. You two are here as well. <laughs> Dude, he's so pissed. <laughs> Hey. Hey, it's gone. Sorry, but uh we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Are you serious? We read about it online. This <laughs> Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? He welcomes pupils into his own home! This is no act of violence, it is charity! And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. You might be lying about it. That... that is utter rubbish. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day! You really think that? Yusuke? What's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors! Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. <sighs> Understood, Sensei. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not 
what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse me. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Maybe the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target, too. How's the MetaNav? Oh. Hey, the app. Was it picking up our conversation? This display. It means that Madarame has a palace, too, right? But why? Madarame, plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what the hell's going on? Does an old man like him really have a palace? We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Madarame mistakes the Shaq for to enter his palace. You mean, like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden, though. Why don't we start with castle? No then, what about prison? No Ugh, what a pain! A jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office! Might as well add farm. No Not a single hit. Should we come back another time? Building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? Beginning navigation? Whoa, really? Well, this whole lottery journey we're on is really taking us to some strange locations, isn't it? You know, I didn't even want to come here. I was here for the lottery, and all of a sudden I'm in the Demon Museum. God. The ways life can take you. Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Probably would have figured it out once he started walking on two legs. <sighs> so even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? Yes. In a place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. Forget that. Look! That shack is seriously some kind of museum? Hell yeah. Let's go check it out. And it's gaudy as fuck. And it's like outright designer engineer it's hell. So extravagant. To the point that it's gaudy. It's a museum, right? This is Matarame's? Well, a palace is a world formed by a mind twisted by desire. Remember Kamoshida's castle? Madarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. This exhibit was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse, either. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Right. That aside, 
Ain't a museum a must for phantom thieves? Now that's our Joker. I feel the same. But man, just look at that insane crowd. Oh, yes. yeah, I'm just here now. <laughs> Forgot I have the clothes changed. Shall we go? All right, there we go. Wow, okay. That was, I was not expecting us to have come through this journey that we have come on through. But all right, okay then. Welcome, Bullet, to the longest detour in existence, even though I am directly progressing in the game's plot. I don't want to wear this anymore. Um, I'll try. I'll try the the Devil Survivor or uh, Strange Journey one. Oh, it is fucking weird seeing a goddamn demonic suit like this. Oh, what a weird fucking timeline. Especially because like that's that's like a Megami Tensei game where you see everyone is like the like the 2D sprites. You never see like a 3D model of anyone. God, it is weird seeing the these like people moving around you know once once you know more about what these people go through you'll start stop seeing these suits as very stupid and oh my god they're absolutely crucial but you know Focus. can i not come up i can come up that way interesting not a lot down there, okay. It's somewhere. Hey. Now's my time to shine. Going in. I don't think I'm actually hmm. I don't think I'm actually like allowed to fight anyone here. How suspicious. At least not yet. Oh. Hmm. This is very trippy. I could absolutely see like a God. I was about to say I could see a horror game like this. But could you imagine if Eve was drawn with this level of fidelity? Holy shit. There's a lot of them. Look at all that. I know a lot of them are generic, but you can really kind of see like a few like familiar-ish looking faces, you know what I mean? They're not quite the same, but they've got that same kind of a vibe to them, you know? Thick parchment. Must search around for more loot. I know this is a dungeon people don't really talk about, but this is one of my favorite ones. This one's just so neat. Focus. Like this is when they start getting like really into it, you know? Hey, this doesn't make any sense. Madarame's famous for having a variety of art styles. But all the portraits on display here look the same. This is way different from what was at the... Wait a sec. Ain't this that guy we saw in Mementos? You know, the, the one who was shit-talking Madarame? Nope. Natsuhiko Nakanohara. His name's written on the plaque. Dude, I don't get it. Why is there a painting of him in here? And more important, why is his name written under... Why is there also like a giant blood splatter? We're not gonna talk about that one. You're right. Doesn't art usually have like the title of the piece or the artist? I like how he's the only one not moving too. Very coincidental and convenient. This is quite the mystery. All right, let's keep looking around for now. Oh, these are tiny little baby ones. This one's a gold one, dude. This dude fucking strove for punch that shit. This dude strove for success. <sighs> Wait a 
Wait. You bitch. Wait. Oh well, not my problem. No, 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 no. Don't look at it. Hey, isn't this a painting of that guy? It says Yusuke Kitagawa. There's no mistaking it. Huh? Wait a second. What do you think these paintings are? They're well painted, that's for damn sure. I think you're right. For real? All of them? But it was only Yusuke when we went to his place before. This must include former pupils as well. Only one remains now. Taking into account what that Nakanohara guy said earlier, things are getting clearer. All right, let's keep investigating. We need something to further confirm our deductions. No, I want the treasure chest. I hear the jangle. Don't splurp me away chest. from it. Thank you. Hello, straw doll. Don't these, wait a minute, aren't these? No, they're not quite what I thought. Okay, so they're... They're not even a low chance. They're not Hama. But they're not... They're not Hamaun. They're like a mid-tier. Interesting. Oh. I mean, I have 16 lockpicks. I wonder where I got nine of those. Or however many. Wanted to hear the broadcast. Ah. Ah. Look at this. The Infinite Spring? A conglomerate work of art that the great director Madarame created with his own funds. These individuals must offer their ideas to the director for the rest of their lives. Those who cannot do so have no worth living? Hey, this is most likely about the plagiarism, right? Damn it, what a phony geezer. In other words, his pupils are his property. He doesn't even qualify as an artist if this is true. He's stealing the ideas from talented students in exchange for securing their livelihood. I wondered about those portraits on display. They must all be his pupils through his cognition. This even says that they have no worth. Couldn't this be about the abuse? Madarame will keep them around as long as they're useful to him. But the moment they're not... He's treating them like slaves or tools! Why is Yusuke keeping quiet about this? He's got no reason to cover this up! He did say that he owes Madarame his life for being taken in. But still, when we were at the exhibit, I praised one of the pieces on display. But Kitagawa-kun acted strange. Maybe that piece was plagiarized too. What's the call? Ain't this enough to target Madarame? We should confirm these facts with Yusuke first. Yeah. Confirm what though? It means we should get solid evidence that such crimes actually took place. What a pain in the ass. Besides, there's too much we don't know about Madarame yet. Mm, 
You're right. I want to fight Perhaps dudes though. I'm protecting Kitagawa Kun. Aww. I might be able to get the truth out of him if I accept his modeling offer. Wait, you're gonna do that? You all better come with me, okay? I'm scared to go alone. A famous, renowned artist, huh? Oh, this might be tougher than Kamoshida. Well, we'll just prep ourselves until we get confirmation from Yusuke. This is our first mission as real phantom thieves. We're gonna succeed no matter what. Hurrah! Well, that was a good use of our time, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, there's so many cutscenes I never ever really had a chance to interject. This has mainly just been a, a silent playthrough, you know what I mean? A long play. plant is healthy I cannot leave mm. fuck mm. god damn it well, well why would you even give me the option just send my ass to bed let's go to bed And we're getting text in the middle of class again. He said he wants me to come over after school today. Perfect. Probably dropped all his plans just to get you over there. We need to find out from Kitagawa-kun if what we saw in the palace was true. Hey, quiet down. It's that student council president. Mishima, you're colluding with the enemy! Yikes. She got hold of Mishima today? Ah, uh, betrayal. It'd suck if she noticed us. Come on, I'll split up. Okay, see you later. We finally landed a big target. Come on, let's get some dirt on Matarame. But man, Han's late. Sorry, I was thinking about some things and didn't notice how much time had passed. Thinking about what? Don't you think Kitagawa-kun has to be protecting Matarame? I mean, they live together, so he'd have to be aware of Matarame's true nature. The only reason I can think of him doing that is that Matarame has something on him. Yeah, that's weird. But that's why we're going to check it out, right? You ready to be a model? Yeah, I'm prepared. What do you mean prepared? Prepared for what? Something seemed different about her to you? Totally right. Hmm? But I'm the same as always. You're not the real one. Goddamn huh. skinwalkers trying well, to get away with it. Let's get going. We gotta talk to Yusuke. 
Kitagawa-kun seemed really happy when I agreed to be his model. Once he finishes drawing and gets a little friendlier, we should bring up Madarame. I thought it would just be you coming, Takamaki-san. Wouldn't you get nervous too? <laughs> it was just the, two of us. <laughs> the fact that every single time we keep showing up. <laughs> We're here to keep an eye on you, so uh, don't try anything perverted, okay? Stop making such odd assumptions. I have absolutely no interest in her as someone of the opposite sex. Get yeah, fucked. Huh? Is there a problem? No. Not really. I mean, it's, it's the kind of thing where it's like, it's not, it's not like she wants it, but it's like, God, it's a fucking insult, man. Like, I get it. I don't want to fuck you, Skate, but at the same time, God damn, man, you gotta just twist the knife a bit. Well then, let's get started. this was gonna happen guess we just gotta wait till he's done what an effing pain in the ass come on man let the man art Perhaps I should try going outside this room hm. who do you think you're talking to this is too boring so I'm going to scout around a bit It's weird how flashy that door is. And is that a lock? A door with a hefty lock. What could be in there? It's the same kind of lock they have on treasure chests. Only good things are back there. <sighs> are you done? It's no good. What? I'm sorry. Am I the problem? No, not at all. It's just... I'm having trouble staying focused today. I'm sorry, but we'll have to resume this another time. Oh, hell no! How Ruji. many hours do you think you made us wait? I'm sorry. We had another reason for seeing you today. We needed to talk to you. It's about those rumors regarding your sensei. Oh, here we go again. This again. In that painting I saw at the exhibit, you're the one who actually painted it, right? That's... I knew it. Your sensei seriously messed up. Ryuji, you are actively not helping right now. That's why he doesn't give a damn whether he steals their work or physically beats them. I'll make this clear. There's no point in hiding stuff from us. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. You couldn't go against him, could you? I'm sure we can help you out, though. Stop it. It's just as you all say. We're our sensei's artwork. Don't misunderstand me, though. I offered my ideas to him myself. As such, it can't be called plagiarism. Sensei is simply suffering from artist's block right now. Dude, still. Kun. Then why are you sticking around? All his other pupils ran away. Aren't you the only one left? What's wrong with a pupil helping out his master? There are no victims here. Stop pushing your self-centered righteousness on me. I'm supporting Sensei as his pupil. Where's the wrong in that? Don't ever come here again. If you do, I'll sue you for causing a disturbance. Hold it! We're not done talking here! Then you leave me with no choice. Hey! 
I'm reporting you to the police. Damn. I gotta say, there's one thing that is very strange about this game is the fact that everyone immediately fucking resorts to I am calling the cops. I asked Takamaki-san to be my model today, but I don't recall ever calling you two here. What the F, man? Yuji, stop it! Calm down! Watch as Ryuji fucking digs us deeper into this shithole. Damn it! I won't report you, but only under one condition. What's that? I want you to continue being my model, Takamaki-san. But you said that it wasn't working out today. That's because I was unconsciously being modest for your sake. However, I have nothing to worry about anymore. If you are willing to bear everything to me, I will put my heart and soul into creating the best nude painting ever. What? Hell yeah. Nude? He's in there. <laughs> uh, to think I'd be able to create a nude painting with my most ideal model. <laughs> you escape fucking dumbass. Of course, you two won't be allowed in, and I ask that you forget about our discussion today as well. If I don't submit a new piece to Sensei soon, there will be some inconveniences. Nude? Meaning it'll be without any clothes, right? Why are things suddenly escalating like that? Because those are my terms. But that's... Wait, ain't that bad? Sensei is out during the afternoon while the art exhibit is on, so I can use this place freely. I should buy more art supplies. Will you give me a second here? He's getting into like a fervent about this, like a fervor. There of you course. go. I'm willing to wait. I'll make time according to your plans. But please come before the exhibit ends. No, that's not what I mean. Why are you not listening? <laughs> oh shit, I'm feeling it. <laughs> Sensei will be returning home soon. <laughs> We're done for today. Takamaki-san, I'll be waiting for you to contact me. No, no, no! We are not done talking here! Hey, what should we do? Oh, bye! Have fun! Yeah, damn it. He got us good this time. Don't give up so easily! We can just fucking palace it. This isn't a problem, on. You forget we have magic. It's fine. Is she done being a model? Hey, cat. A cat? You moron. He's totally out of his mind. I'm gonna have to pose nude if this keeps up. We have magic. It's fine. Dare that you skate. The way he said it, it's not gonna be semi but full on nude. <laughs> yeah, shut the fuck Drop up. It. You know, you won't have to worry about that if we make Madarame confess before the exhibit ends. But Kitagawa kun thinks he owes his life to him. Is there a need to make Madarame confess? Yes. Then, Lady On, you're fine with bearing it all? I am not! Madarame's no different from Kamoshida. That asshole's using Yusuke who doesn't have parents. You're telling me we should just ignore how he's being treated horribly like the other pupils? No. It is frustrating to leave this alone, even if Kitagawa-kun is fine with it himself. You can't leave it be because you've endured a lot yourself with Kamoshida. Yeah. Anyways, we gotta go after this guy. Madarame is the kind of target we've been waiting for. Let's help Yusuke come to his senses too. Before he ends up like us. Right. We need to look into Madarame first. There might be tons more stuff that hasn't been exposed yet too. It may become easier for us to investigate his palace if he's preoccupied with his exhibit. Also, there's the thing about me modeling. Kitagawa-kun said there'd be inconveniences unless he submits a new piece. Maybe that's going to be announced soon as Madarame's next work. Does that mean the whole country's gonna see you nude? Probably. No way. Hell no. 
We must deal with Matarame, no matter what, before his exhibit ends. Let's start after school tomorrow. Oh, it'll be a pain if Miss President finds us on the rooftop again, so... Uh, where to meet up? Let's see... I guess that walkway-like place in Shibuya would work. It's near Matarame's place, too. Changing our hideout periodically, huh? That's a plan I don't mind backing. Hey, uh, can I talk to you kids for a sec? I forgot you were in the game, lady. Huh? From the looks of things, you don't seem like the ordinary stalking fans. Uh... Oh, sorry. I should have been more clear. I'm actually looking for people that know Madarame's pupils. There's this painting, Sayuri, that was supposedly stolen in the past. But there's this rumor that it was taken by one of his pupils in retaliation for being abused. Have you heard anything about that? Hey, Reggie. Me? I don't know nothing. I see. There's no case. Throw Reggie under the bus. There's no proof of abuse. I can't write either. Looks like I'm back to square one. Sorry for taking your time. I'm a journalist. If you ever get any leads, mind contacting me here? See you then. Goodbye. I guess we should go home. Well, today. that's not going to be important. Technically. Somewhat. Can, can I? Can I go outside now? <sighs> Am I allowed to enact upon the world now? Hey, it's me. Got a minute? I have some interesting news. Someone who received a change of heart contacted me on the fan site. Said he wants to meet with you to discuss another person who needs a change of heart. You're better off talking to him in person if you want specifics. All I know is his target is a terrible person. And that it might complicate things if he posted the name online. I'll have him wait for you at Shibuya Station after school. The guy's name is Nakanohara. Nakanohara? That's Matarame's student. I told him to approach you. Good luck. Our fun is exploding right now, like my lord. spoke of is true there have to be other victims fantastic can i do the plan nope can i leave nope fucking why give me the choice the illusion of free will touch the tv hey hey i gotta wonder do i care more about knowledge or do i care more about proficiency or do i care more about getting a random plus five max hp the answer to that is no um I don't even remember what fucking proficiency is used for. I do not remember a single, like, proficiency gate in the game. So I guess we'll just go with studying for right now. Now listen up. What do you want to do? I can also go outside. I don't think there's anything to do out here. Never mind, I guess I can't. Now listen. What do you want to do? Make sure you close up. Oh, I guess the proficiency gate is, you know, the Big Bang Burger challenge. That's guts, proficiency, and knowledge, so both of these will be relevant. But... I'll try to get, like, another notch of knowledge before I start focusing on proficiency again. <laughs> but then again, proficiency is entirely gated upon how many tools I can make, so we'll have to see on that one. Fuck out with that shit, lol. Well, oh my god. Oh, no! No! <laughs> I was almost free. Yo. We're about to head to the hideout, too. Who's that? 
Excuse me. That's Nakanohara. Mishima told us to meet him here in Shibuya today. For real? My name is Nakanohara. Natsuiko Nakanohara. The one who was posted about on the Phantom Aficionado website. He seems pretty nice. Doesn't seem like the stalker type. I think the change of heart must have worked. The administrator of that website contacted me. They told me to look for someone in a Shujin uniform with a cat. So, what do you want? You may have already heard, but there's someone I wish to trigger a change of heart in. An artist by the name of Madarame. <gasps> you think this is it? Is the pupil gonna confess his master's secrets? His shadow did mention Madarame as well. I'm one of Madarame's former pupils. He gave me lodging at his home, where I thought only about art. I genuinely wanted to be an artist. There was another pupil as well, a very talented man, multiple years my senior. Obviously, Madarame kept tabs on him. Everything he made was claimed as a Madarame original. He wasn't the only victim, though. Right, we got some real proof of the plagiarism. In response to Madarame's actions, that senior pupil committed suicide. Suicide? He must have been unable to bear seeing his work praised under Madarame's name. That was when I disobeyed Madarame's orders and left. But he quickly pressured other parts of the art world, and my life as a painter was destroyed. I tried to turn over a new leaf working at a ward office, but it was no use. My attachment to art warped my emotions. Soon I began getting attached to everything. In the end, I even turned into a stalker. <laughs> I don't know why they, this dude has a really goddamn powerful voice for how small of a role he plays in this. He's probably someone else, you know, but it's it's very funny that he's this guy, you know what I mean? I'd like to ask again, please make Madarame have a change of heart. Not only for me, it's to save the life of another man as well. Even now, there's still one young man remaining under Madarame's tutelage. I think he's about your age. That has to be Yusuke. Not only is he a talented artist, he also owes Madarame for taking him in after his mother passed. He is the perfect target. So Yusuke's got no choice but to listen. I actually spoke to him a few times back when I was still living at Madarame's. I asked him if he found it painful to stay with Madarame. And you know what he said? If I could leave, I would. Kitago Akun. I have no right to say this given my prior cowardice but I don't want to see another suicide. I'd like to find a way to save this young man. He has a bright future ahead of him. Please consider that when thinking about changing Madarame's heart. We've been asked to act directly on behalf of one of Madarame's victims. It sounds like we don't have the time to deliberate whether or not to change Madarame's heart. Yeah, Madarame's just a piece of shit who preys on the weak. Suicide. I'll never let something like that happen. Plus, we finally got to hear how Kitago Akun really feels. Well, since we've reached a unanimous decision, how about we continue this at our new hideout? My fellow thieves! Welcome to our new hideout. In the middle of public, oh yeah! Our target this time is Madarame. We all saw that palace. We'll pay dearly if we assume it's just going to be like the last one. Furthermore, Lady An's chastity is on the line. What? <laughs> we need to do what we did with the fuck? <laughs> First, we secure an infiltration route in the palace. After that, we send our calling card. Once the treasure has materialized, we steal it. Oh, oh, I got a question. Uh, Madarame doesn't know that we were doing stuff in the palace yet. Why are we already getting treated like criminals in there? You're learning, Ryuji. Well done. It must be because he doesn't trust anyone. Any unknown person may as well be an enemy. Or maybe he's bullshit. just super salty from all those rumors that have been spreading about it's him. It's bullshit. 
Then his palace being so crazy had nothing to do with us? Either way, we should stay on our best behavior. It'll be harder for us to steal the treasure if we needlessly increase the security level. We need to be careful of Kitagawa-kun this time, too. I'm sure that whatever he sees will just get passed on to Madarame. That's right. Hey, what is Madarame's treasure going to look like anyway? Another crown? I doubt that, but my sixth sense will know when I see it. Oh yeah, you go completely nuts, huh? Our time limit is when the exhibit ends, right? That means... June 5th. We'll carry out the plan after we've sent out the calling card. So our infiltration route will need to be set in stone two days prior on June 2nd. Now listen here! We can't mess this up, no matter what, okay? Wong you don't need to yell on. Jeez, I get it. Okay. Okay, all right. So, Bullet, are you still here? I know it's been uh, a full hour since, you know, anything. Ooh, bread. Are you ready to order? Oh. Now I can finally show you the thing I wanted to. Assuming you're even still here. I see you're in the viewer list, but you haven't, you know, been. Can I? Can I please have... Can I please have an Ojidu? I know I'm like half a week late, but please. You don't understand. The homeless man? Okay, thank you, homeless man. Oh, I guess Bullet's dead. I guess we will, ha we will have the the old lottery showdown another time. Mm. Is there anything I want to do? Okay, I was going to check out the, um... Maybe we could rank up. That's good. I want to... get a new DVD if possible, because I've watched them all now. <sighs> And see what do. Could also drop by the weapon shop. Hopefully that won't advance my time. A little bit of back change in the pocket. Take a look around. Well, that's there for now. Good shit. I'm going to pop a save just before we come in here, just hoping that this doesn't, Let's like, do it. it forcibly advance my time. You know what I mean? You don't get to talk to this guy until you have tier four guts. Despite the fact that he is one of the earliest available social links, he is one of the latest available social links. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, all right. At least it didn't consume time. All right, let's see what here. A theme. I don't want lower accuracy. Oh, I guess it's a lot of fucking money, huh? Skimtar. The old skin ripper. But guns okay. are the most important All stat. Right, which one? My accuracy goes down, but it fucking almost double. It gives me a fucking 50% damage increase. Actually, not buy a gun for my main dude because I'm gonna be casting magic, namely. 
So my weapon will now be the least relevant. This has the most ammo, and I know the fact that it can't be aimed, but if I'm targeting one person, it'll do the most damage, which is a good threshold maker. ever going to be relevant. All right. How do I? Oh, there we go. Okay. I guess that's fine. All right. Okay. All right. Which one? Okay. All right. I guess that's fine. Okay. All right. I'm just short. Damn. Um. Yeah, I can sell for 1,200. That's not much. All right. Gotta have a lot of these, huh? Oh well. We'll be able to get rid of them later. Where's the ra I wish there was a way of differentiating properly between, like, food and whatnot. I guess it's these ones down here, even though they don't actually specify. Which is weird, because you have to be able to use these ones in combat. Otherwise, they don't make sense. Huh. <sighs> Big Bang Burger, but that's like weaker. The Earth Burger is the good shit. Hmm. I actually don't really have anything I particularly want to sell. <laughs> I guess I'll do these ones because they're the least relevant. Fine. Okay. No, not armor. Sounds good. Anyway, don't want to give uh, give the new gun to uh, Ryuji because I don't want him to miss. You know what I mean? He has the least amount of ammo, and that does not up his ammo capacity. Lowering his accuracy is death. All right, there we go. How do I go to my? Oh, is it over here? Oh, it was yeah. Welcome to Madarame's Palace. Wow, I wasn't expecting to get this started today, but here we go. Alright, we're off. Here's your velvet room. Yeah, 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 I know. Oh, no, I am not... I am, uh... Doing this now, I guess. Ignore the fact that I am a man from Strange Journey now, Igor. You didn't see that. Actually, no, he didn't see it because I'm not wearing it anymore. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Man. Excellent. I expect no less. Oh. Oh, that's right. 
I forgot about this system. So yeah, we're gonna start getting into content I've never seen before, because I only barely finished this palace. I Beyond this point, I'm gonna start getting into straight up just new content. I think I like about started Palace 3, so we still have a ways to go, but I forgot about the trait system. This wasn't in base P5. Interesting. Those can make or break a persona. <laughs> Marvelous. Ben. You sir. The inmate to change your mind, Justine. You have registration. You'd like to register this? Hell yeah, I want to register Mile Barry on. He's a good man. The inmate you wished for fusion. Let us begin the search. Well, let me actually see the ones I have right now. Trait striking weight. Physical skills by 20%. Increased chance of inflicting burn? That's worthless. Okay, well, obviously. Oh. Okay. None of these are at all relevant. So I'm gonna need to have one of every element on uh, our boy now. I have fire, light... Fire, light, dark, electric. Okay. What path do you want? You okay with this? I already had a Soki before. Not terrible, but not impressive. Owl odor. Reach chance of putting Aelin's under a down bass irrelevant, but you come with Augie. But I lose out on Koha. I don't want to do that. Not terrible. Bufu. We lose out on Nagi though. I don't want to do that. You okay with this? You okay with this? But I like my Oberion. Look at him. No, man. It's my Oberion. Let's see what else we've got. I'm level 13. Terrible. Oh, he's gonna learn Psy. That's very good. Learn Zeo. Okay, I carry everything over with this one. This one's gonna be huge. I really want this one. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Oh, I can fucking carry. Oh my god, that's stupid. Okay. Increases damage after a baton pass. I don't know whether if this is me accepting a baton pass or giving a baton pass. So I'll instead be immune to uh, getting hit by a weakness. Its power will be nothing unusual. Now for a rebirth. So I'll need to level him up to get Psy, but yeah, this this is gonna be a good one. Kodama. Yaxini. Excessive power only leads to destruction. Not terrible. Hey, it's a it's Mitama. Oh, you know, Medea. Oh. And I lose out on Aya. But at the same time, I gain access to Medea, which is very good, as well as regenerators. Very nice. But whatever, fuck off. You okay with this? Hey Orpheus, how you doing? Goodbye. Not terrible, but not in Ma Bufu, very good. Oh, fucking it's always with Kodama! No! Not terrible, but not impressive. Uh, again I lose out on Augie if I do this. But uh I gain access to Bufu. I trade Augie out for Bufu. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Its power will be nothing I need now for a reason. That's fine. I can always resummon him, you know. 
Plus, we're going to be getting some new guys. I'm just trying to get as much coverage as I can. I'm just trading fire for ice, and that's okay. It gets rid of a persona, also. It frees up a slot. It gets us a new guy. It's fine. Not terrible, but not impressive. See, now we just get even more value. Now I get to carry over Koha and Aiha. And I keep the Bufu, and I just shave off another slot. The skills you'd like to inherit. Sure, decrease the cost of SP, cost of ice skills. Sure, Koha and Aiha. It will receive a fraction of my my. Perfect. Thinning, thinning the ranks right now. That's all we're here for. Hello, Hiho. Nice. Get as many new as you can as well. A Bufu. Oh, Rakunda. That'll be big. Nice. Oh, power I'm gonna get banned on the Twitch, the YouTube, if I'm at it. Oh, actually, this looks fucking huge. Actually, increase effective support skills cast on allies. Is that is that include buffs? That's fucking insane. Oh my god. You change your mind? You'd like to read the I don't really have any money though. Yeah, want. I have no money. Done already? Oh. What? It is time, inmate. Time to scrounge up some cash out the ass. That's for damn sure. Need to get as many personas as we can, and beyond that, to start slamming out some cash. Come on. Let's do it. I should write something. I thought for a second they weren't in the party. I'm like, did they really just remove? On and Ryuji from the party, despite the fact that there's no reason to do that. No. I want to go this way. Yes. Yeah, but I want to fight those dudes, though. Look Somewhere. at that. There's a red man. Man, those are real fake dudes. Bastard. I'm going. I'm going. Give me some time. I like how awful that looks animation-wise. Oh, hello. Whoa. Come on, man. Focus. What's up, shithead? Time to get some violence. Um. Hmm. Hmm. You know, I don't think the game likes the fact that I am a strange journeyman. There we go. I've already had you before. You are worthless to me. And yes, Strange Journey music. Why is the game shitting that I'd like to do things, game? Come on! Why? I want your money. No. <laughs> Goodbye. Let's pull back for now. Yeah, Strange Journey music is this intense and ominous. To be fair, it kind of makes sense. Strange Journey is definitely a game where everything is tense and shitty and it all sucks. At all times, forever. That was not a back attack somehow, but okay. Hey, Huapo! Yeah, I figured. Cool, 
Hey, I haven't talked to you before. You're irritable. Lend me your power. What a grouch. Just be the better man and act the opposite. Oh, fuck. Why well, it said me to do the opposite? What the fuck do you mean? Uh, nothing. Oh. You bitch. That's not what I wanted. You come back here. Especially because that's especially worthless, especially. You gave me nothing. You gave me 10 XP and a waste of my time. Fucking respawn her ass, I'm hunting her damn. Yoink. Yoink again? I didn't even know I could do that, that's neat. I'll reveal your truth. Hello, sexy! <laughs> that's what you get for being an explosive one. Joker. See, look at that. Like, that's an acceptable amount of experience okay. points. Ah, uh, you Victor. bitch. Why are you now yellow? You were not yellow before. I'll reveal your true form. Absaurus? Alright. Oh, time to hope for the best. Not that. Just stay there. Hey, I did not intend for that to crit, but I'll take it. What's up? Look at it clumping around. Better not make any wise cracks. Take responsibility? Although like that, yeah. They're serious answers. Uh, oh. yeah. No, you bitch! I did one right! God, I fucking hate this system. I hate it so much. Apparently, Huapo is actually, uh, Takemi. And I can't talk to her either. Fucking hate demon negotiations. Oh, well, that's fucking new. Holy shit, okay. Also, I didn't even notice it, but this door is, like, weird and jagged and slanted, and that's really cool. Okay, I gotta say, I really like this dungeon. It's super fucking cool. It's somewhere. Bat. Yeah, we're gonna be getting some straight up new content coming up soon once we're done with this palace. Also, hey Sion, welcome. Man, you uh you missed some shit, didn't you? And you uh it's been a while. Can you both not be here? I'll Thanks. Your true form. Huh? Calling you out from the afterlife. Let's go. Not that. Some other way. I don't see a weak spot. Persona! Persona! Persona. 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 Okay. Goodbye. Focus. Oh, that was both of them. Okay. Hey. Here we are. I do like the fact that the uh, 
the spring, the infinite spring or whatever it's called, is just screaming and moaning and wailing. That's haunted as hell, dude. If you've ever seen like a demon conduit, God, you're looking at it. That bitch fucking haunted. The cognition here is with. Ooh, I got a text. I don't, this is a nice I don't know where my fucking room. phone is right now. Oh, it's over there. It's overcharging. I ain't dealing with it. I should write something. Pop a save. And uh, yeah, things are gonna get so much just comedically easier now that I have the Invigorate 3 band, because. Uh, <laughs> Um, Careful. yeah, now I never have to see like my whole first like dungeon experience is me extensively trying to conserve as much SP as humanly possible. Oh, now I just don't have to care anymore. Oh, hi, Shisa. Um, I think these dudes are weak to like ice. They're usually resistant to fire, I do believe. Let me check. No. Damn. Oh, let's check. Not guns. Physical skills? Nope. Ow. Hmm, well that didn't work. Let me see. You haven't tried wind and electric yet. Wind? No. Nope. Let's try fire, actually. Oh, I burned him. That's not too useful, though. My body on fire. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, I can use wind on him to, to technical his ass. All right, sure. Took one out. All, right. All right, let's try electric. No, I do not have this dude's weakness, whatever it is. Well, actually, it could be light or dark. I haven't done those ones yet, so who really knows? I have no idea what traits are randomly fucking procking, but I'm all right with it. No, they're immune to that. Okay, not not light. God, I have literally tried every fucking status, every single damage type except for dark. Fuck Jesus, dude. No wonder I didn't know what their weakness is. It's new to this game. And I, huh. <sighs> the very final option. Watch I fucking piss away my MP, huh? Jesus. Okay. Oh, that was painful. Let's keep going. Oh, an enemy. I'll reveal your truth. Going in. This dude's on fire. This dude's big and scary. Oh, this dude reflects physical, doesn't he? I remember this guy. I think he's weak to something fun. I think he's weak to like psychic or some weird shit like that. We're gonna have to try magic though, because you cannot hit this dude with uh, you know, the conventionals. Doing that, I'll start with uh, Bufu. Oh, normally you would like physically attack him now to get a crit, but that's not a good idea. Not wind. It's not electric. It's not fire. Okay. How about Koha? Nope. How about a physical attack? Yep, I was right. Yeah. I remember! So, so yeah, the only thing we have left is dark. I was right, it is something fucked and weird. I kinda wanna run, actually. Oh, 
It's not worth it to fight him right now. Just not even gonna take that kind of a fight. Do I even have revivals? No, that's right, I spent- oh yeah, she's back to life, it doesn't even matter, never punished. Oh, okay. Hey, how's it going? Random ass weird new hallway. Okay. Oh, what an idea. Hmm. Oh, a treasure chest somewhere. Cool. Fantastic. Okay. I'll reveal your true form. Come here, you. I already have you guys. You're worthless to me. I need to regenerate some MP, so that's why I'm not actually using magic right now. Okay, well, bye. <laughs> I need to look at what the traits of my party members are, though, because I have no fucking idea. Hey, how's it going? You want to give me some cash? I already have one of you. I need money. That's a worthless amount of money. Hope you guys can see the empirical proof that obviously Ana is the worst party member because she has now died twice. Truly, she is a sin monger. Oh. Adam ring. Okay, this probably gives us access to nuclear if I had to assume. Yeah. Yep. But hey, that's a new, uh, that's another damage type, and once, uh, our little boy levels up, that's gonna be fucking every single damage type of the second dungeon. Very nice. You don't, you don't wanna fuck with this guy. Oh no, there's a powerful looking shadow. Not until we have access to all the damage types. Don't, don't worry about it right now. Oh, yeah, it's this room. <laughs> hey, wait a second. You're just gonna ignore that golden sheen? Hmm. Look at that luster. I know it might be tough to take with us, but don't you think it'd sell for tons? Come on, we didn't come here to. Wait, hold on, you're stepping on something. Isn't this bad? Oh no, I tripped the security. Uh, you were the one making us be careful too. So, what do you want to do? Run out of here? No, passing through all of these lasers will draw far too many enemies to our location. Oh, hold on, Joker's not trapped. Sorry, Joker, but we're going to need you to search for a way to turn off these infrared lasers. This is a you museum, fucked it, Morgan. So there has to be some switch to let the workers avoid these lasers. Find it. You're just assuming that, but then again, this is a security system, and that wouldn't really make sense now, would it? Going up! Hey, time for Joker solo adventure. Nice. I'm a stealth god, you don't see shit. 
Is there nothing down here? I know there is something down here. I don't know why the fuck he hurt me. Press the button. Hans free. Yes. Come on, join the party. Seriously, thank you. Actually, now that I'm like uh, in this a bit more, I do actually think uh, Ryuji's ability to take more stealthy approaches to uh, various areas and running would be pretty good, actually. Going in! Is this... Are you standing on the thing? You're damaging it. Focus. God damn it, Morgana, you've ruined everything. Not if you spell, f not if you use the four phrasing like that. You have to, you have to use the different way to write four. Hey. Zero one one three four. No. No. You don't write sevens like that. It's wrong. You write lowercase, not uppercase. Sorry. Stop touching shit. Hmm. All right, I'm looking at it. Damn it. Surprise. Hello. Ah, uh, this tutorial. For real? There we are. Regent. Persona. Persona. Go down. There we go. Oh, uh, hey. There we go. Got the Regent Mask. Those are in the base game, and they're very, very, very broken. We will experiment shortly once I find a safe room. They are treasure demons. Give you lots of experience. Yeah, but it's more important to catch them. Break objects, we can take demons, especially when the security level is high. Ooh. Treasure demons cannot be used as in battle, but they're very useful fusion material, as we'll learn about. Once I find a safe room, which should be right here, yep. I'm gonna go check that out and show you all why that dude's so good. So, you know, I did say in my first playthrough I used, um... Let's do it. I used Arsene through the whole game. 
Yeah, uh, there's a very good way I was able to do that. <laughs> Something. Of course, it wasn't a solo Arsen run, because I didn't have any plans of, uh, doing that from the beginning. And even at the ending of the game, I occasionally swapped over for healing and other such needs. But, uh, Arsen was my hallway guy for a long, the whole fucking game. Hey, Subway, it's stress to be out, man. And then this right here. What's the assignment? Now. Ah, so we're doing this side quest, okay. You, so now I have to make them a specific. I already have a Jack Frost. It, it, I already have that. Listen up, inmate. Farewell. Oh, I I did. <laughs> I, I have it. Huh? I I mean I have the. Per oh, we're doing this right now. Okay. It seems you brought the specified persona. Huh. Fine, I'll take it. Please don't take my Jack Frost. Your personas are super weak. Not that I'm surprised, inmate. I also need to look at my teammates' traits. Ah, oh, Jesus. Though I guess you deserve at least some praise for finishing your penal labor. You might actually complete your rehabilitation. In order to promote that process, we would like to offer you the use of a new facility. And this is why you do these side quests. <laughs> it's rare to see you smile, Justine. You are the smiling one, Caroline. Did something happen to make you so joyful? Me? <gasps> hey, are you laughing at us? I sure am. Know your place, inmate. As wardens, we simply feel satisfaction in seeing your rehabilitation progress. That is the extent of it. I find it upsetting that you would see such a matter as a source of amusement. It's like you forget where you are, inmate. You've got some real guts, though. With that spirit, you should have no trouble making progress. Very well, then. Give me a point of guts for if that, you then. Have the will to continue Give such a, such a qualm about a game. We grant you greater freedom within this prison. It is a deal between us, the wardens, and you, the inmate. Not like you have the right to turn it down, though. Hard work is what you're meant to do, inmate. There we are. In the middle of a palace, too. Look at that. With the birth of the strength persona. Strength. Okay. Nice. Hey, we got three-way fusion now. Good shit. What's our next side quest, eh? Farewell. Amino Uzume with Frey. Frey. Okay. Also, that's Uzube. Hell yeah. Justine, you you want to register it? You'd like to register this? The inmate you wish to perform an execution. Advanced gathering. fusion. Look at that. Okay, so these aren't, so these actually aren't three-way fusions, these are special fusions. So for right now, Flora, like, you can see that these are just the special ones. Oh yeah, here's the obligatory, like, fucking DLC shit ones. Izanagi no Okami. And Izanagi no Okami Picaro. And it's also bullshit that you can just buy them, you know what I mean? They're meant to be like this. Wow, Country Maker. Increased attack defense based on the uh, fucking inmate registry completion. And he resists everything. Very stupid. Foul Stench. Increased chance of inflicting status helmets. Damn. Oh, yeah. If that's actually the case, that means Foul Stench isn't a move in this game. Yeah, Foul Stench used to be a move in some of the previous Persona games and Megami Tensei games because it just increases the ailment susceptibility of everyone. So I guess that just does that too. Pinch Anchor. After Baton Pass, allows use of skills only available when surrounded. Yeah, there are a few absurdly good skills that are actually only accessible when you are surrounded, a la when you're playing the game badly. 
I've never actually been able to use them, but I know some of them are genuinely and utterly absurd. However, you need to baton pass, meaning the usability is definitely limited in boss fights. Oh well. Here, give me just a sec. There we go. Okay. Tam Lin, Glutton Mouth, and Plavros, also Glutton Mouth. Okay. Let us begin the search. So let's see here. Let us begin the search. Yeah, Obar wow, they actually go back to Arsene. Interesting. Let us be do you really need this? Yeah, so this is the gimmick with Regent. The ultimate vessel, huh? Acquiring bo bonus traits when fusing with a treasure demon. Oh. Interesting. Pinch anchor. Oh yeah, Arsena's pinch anchor, neat. But yeah, this is why the uh, these dudes are utterly absurd. The, he has the maw of every single element. And you know what? Fuck it, he's right here. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do the same shit. This is literally what I did in my playthrough. You'd like to inherit. Oh, look God, look at that. Skillful combo, mighty gaze. Increases magic skills targeting all foes by 20%. Why, yes, I will take that actually. Because we already have Mabufu. I'll go Maiha. Would he learn Maiha naturally? Maybe, we'll actually withhold on that. Mafrai, Masai, and then, hmm. So we have Mabufu. We'll take Magaru and Mazio, because Burn is the least relevant. It will receive a fraction of power. So yeah, that whole reason I was using the other guy, Kotodama, well, he has immediately just been benched. The only thing that is annoying is the fact that Arsene cannot learn Ma. Ma Koha or whatever the hell, the light one, but the hell, that's fine. Begin. What's up, Arsene? How you doing? Back in the party. He's level one. I don't care. Now he is cleaved, too. Sure, why not? Now choose. Look at him. Yeah, Mabufu. We lost access to our Dia, actually, which is a little annoying, but we can just get another one. Why not? And I hit enemies 20% harder because of my fucking talent. That's even more stupid. Okay, let me go into here. Yeah. Are you able to resummon Regent? You are, actually. Interesting. How cute. This persona? Hey, what's the cheapest one that knows Dia? Is it you? Is this what you want? Yes. You'll withdraw this persona. This is your pop. You lack pay done already. You lack pay what? done already? Yes, I am. Goodbye. It is time, inmate. So yeah, that is why Regent is absurdly good. Uh you don't really need to deal damage when you knock down every enemy in every fight. I should write something. Oh, we're gonna bank that fucking progress. Oh boy, our boy Arsene is back and ready for action. And you bet I'm gonna be keeping him for a long time. Cause he's fun. Now the fact that he has this gaze skill, he's gonna inherently hit harder than everything else. And hell, you, you don't want him to hit any less hard, in fact. Reveal your true form. This is a fun bit. It's very fun. Weak to fire and electric, eh? I actually don't have fire. God damn it. Go 
Okay. I don't have you yet. Come here. This is awesome. Poor thing. It looks scared to death. It's timid. I apologize. More what are you talking about? Oh. No, fuck off. God damn it. A spectacular victory. You're a right bastard, you know that. I'm, like, not allowed to get Personas at all, apparently. Bathroom. Yo! Value! Cut it out. I think I'm not gonna immediately walk into the women's restroom now that I'm in Demon Museum, dude. Absolute. Why is the game shitting the bed so hard? Chocker Choker. This gives us mana. I'm actually gonna give this to Ryuji. Actually, no, I'm not. Mana's mana, even if it isn't much. Yeah, I have no idea why my game is just shitting the ever-loving fucking bed, Careful. but okay. I saw a shadow. Violence! Bye-bye! Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I guess we're gonna be done soon, so yeah, this is uh, not exactly playable right now. It's almost scary how good I am. It's I'm actually gonna baton pass, so that way I can uh, hopefully get him to cry, and that way I can save my SP. Yeah, I guess so. I guess after this we're gonna be done. After this fight, we're gonna go back to the. Uh... Oh well, you're not running, okay. Nice work, team. Well, I guess that'll be that then. It'll be just a bit of a shorter one this time, on top of the fact that it's already a shorter one. Right. Level up. Oh, you leveled up multiple times. Adverse Resolve. Nah, that's irrelevant. None of these are relevant, but Sukuna is nice. I was kind of hoping okay. he'd learn my hub, but it is a bit too early for them to be just handing that one out, really. Alright, we'll fight one more guy. Come on, you gotta... Okay, this is, I'm honestly just curious to see how well the game will hold up with one more fight, but it's not gonna even get to another fight. <laughs> it's even lagging my OBS now. Wow, the game is not having a good day right now. Ah, uh, it's like back to my good old days when I was playing on the goddamn PS4 net play across the country. Except, you know, this is on my computer right now. Hey, what's up? The water nymph speaks very slowly at that. Give me your power. Hey, I don't need to. I don't need to acknowledge your stupid talking mini game if I make them join me at their request. Come here, you. You've got a new mask, Joker. Devils. Man. Devil Survivor, de uh, uh, Strange Journey, that's the one. Strange Journey is a uh, hell on the old computer, isn't it? Hell yeah! A new move! I don't care about Adverse Resolve. It may increase allies' physical attacks by 40%. That's actually really... R oh my god, Ryuji, that is fucking insane. It's a random chance. Like a Proud Presence, increase the effects of allies' healing skill. Oh my god. That's fucking so good. No wonder those are proc. They was proc all the fucking time. Now take your time, it's okay. I gotta use this next time. 
may decrease the decrease the SP cost of allies' magic skills. That's actually really good too, at least for now. All right. But I've already talked about physical skills being busted as fuck. Ryuji out here being like, yeah, they can just deal 40% more damage randomly. Yes. Yes, I'm vi <laughs> I got all the audio cut out. Okay, I'm sorry, game. Whatever. Yes, I'm very happy about that. So what's the fact that I'm already regenerating MP? I don't need even more MP reduction, but it's nice to have. All right. All right. God, everything is not having a good day right now. Let's 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 get the hell out of here. You know what I mean? God, getting regen absolutely blew this game up. Oh boy. Anyway, I hope you all have enjoyed. Happy, have a good rest of your day. And I need to end the stream right now. Bye bye. I can't right now. My OBS is now lagging. <laughs>